Hello and welcome back everyone, Anthwolf here with what, Mass Effect once again, part 54 I believe it is. Where we last left off, obviously we had the aftermath of the events that had transpired on Vermeer, and we returned to the Citadel, which is where we are right now, we're here in the entertainment bar, maybe restaurant slash casino, imagining bar slash casino, uh, known as Flux. Ambassador Odina of the Human Systems Alliance basically screwed us, stabbed us in the back, and is working alongside the Citadel Council in fortifying the Citadel, preventing Saren from bringing his Geth fleet in from the Terminus systems. Ignoring the entire issue that Saren is going to find a conduit on the planet Ilos, which is in the Terminus systems by using the Mu Relay. So, Captain Anderson has um, proposed a questionable way to get the Normandy free from its impound, which we're going to take him up on, of course. You ready to get the hell off this station, Commander? Let's do it. I'll take care of the lockdown. You get down to the Normandy and tell Joker to stand by. Okay. To get ourselves over to CSEC Academy once again. I uh, want to go to the wards location. We want to go to CSEC Academy. Treaty negotiations between the Alliance and the Solarian Republic have finally concluded. Solarians praised the openness and flexibility of Alliance negotiators in pursuing a deal that benefited both sides. The deal was brokered by new Alliance negotiator Thomas Kent after his mentor Elias Keeler withdrew, citing health reasons. Ah, oh, good. So, the we don't know what the deal actually was, but the Solarians have praised humanity for their efforts. What was it for again? Was it trade? I think it was a trade agreement deal. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination. Anderson, what are you doing here? I didn't send. <laughs> Get us out of here, Joker. Now. He's, uh, he, as in Captain Anson, is probably in some serious trouble, but between the two options you get and how to disable a lockdown, punching Ambassador Dina is probably the most satisfying. Now we need to go to Ilos. I don't think there's anything else we need to say. I don't think there's anything else we really need to talk about. No, I think everyone's prepared. Yeah. Uh, hmm. Actually, one thing we may do, let's have a quick word with Joker. He'll be our test audience. Our test discussion. Make him undoubting myself whether or not we should talk to our crew members. Even though we only did in the last video. Aw, oh, damn it, no sign of pursuit? I was hoping the council would send some ships after us. I was looking forward to putting the Normandy through her paces. Figured I'd get to see what this ship can really do. Saren's still out there. 
Maybe we'll get a chance to play hide and seek with Sovereign. You know, it doesn't seem like much fun when you say it, Commander. So you need something? I have to go. All right, see ya. Nope. Okay, so it might be worthwhile having a quick run around before we go to Ilos. So we only just spoke to people maybe, well, less than an hour ago actually, but worth seeing if they're all ready because like Vermeer, this could be a one-way trip. Uh, let's talk to Liara since she's the nearest one of our crew now. I get the feeling you want to ask me something, Commander. I just wanted to talk. Of course, Shepard. What did you want to talk about? Ah, so nothing new. Okay, that's fair. I should go. Goodbye, Shepard. Um... Ashley, no. Rex, no. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. So we have slightly less shields wearing the Titan X armor compared to the armor we were wearing before. But it offers us a lot greater damage protection when our shields finally go down. Apart from that, I think we're all set up really. Okay. So, um, yeah. Let's get ourselves underway. Ilos in the Pangea Expanse. Is there anywhere new we can visit? Don't think so. Refuge system. Okay, we've traveled through the Moo Relay, and we're now in the refuge system where Ilos is. So it, Ilos is not the only planet in this system. Really, we shouldn't be doing any sightseeing, but we might as well quickly check out the other planets. No. Okay. In the golden age of the Protheans, Ilos was a verdant world dotted with the spires and arches of magnificent cities. Even casual observation shows this is no longer the case. Ilos has been devastated by means unknown, its entire surface changed to the colour of rust. The atmosphere shows heightened levels of oxygen. Wildfires presumably ignited by lightning strikes can be seen burning on the dark side. This indicates that most, if not all, resp- was it? Respiring animal life forms have died off. Surface gravity is a comfortable 1.17 standard G's. Shepard, may I speak with you? I was just thinking about you. I have been thinking about you too, and what we are about to face. I do not know what is going to happen on Ilos. I hope we will stop Saren, of course, but part of me fears we are already too late. There is something I must tell you, in case we fail. Go ahead. I'm listening. These could be our last moments together. Our last chance to show each other how we feel. I want this to be special. We don't have to do this. Not unless you're sure. I have never been more sure of anything in my life. Will you join with me, Shepard? Let our bodies and minds unite. Just tell me what to do.
By the goddess. That was incredible, Shepard. You were incredible. Five minutes ETA to the Mew Relay. I had better go. Duty calls. You would not want to keep Joker waiting. Shepard, whatever happens on Ilos, I just wanted to say... Thank you. For everything. Commander, we've got company. Have their sensors picked us up yet? Well, stealth systems are engaged. Unless we get close enough for a visual, they won't have any idea we're here. Picking up some strange readings from the planet's surface. Take us down, Joker. Lock in on the coordinates. Negative on that, Commander. The nearest landing zone's two clicks away. We'll never make it in time on foot. Get us something closer. There is nowhere closer. I've looked. Drop us in the Mako. You need at least 100 meters of open terrain to pull off a drop like that. The most I can find near Saren is 20. 20 meters? No way we can make a drop in there. We have to try. Find another landing zone! There is no other landing zone! The descent angle's too steep. It's our only option. It's not an option. It's a suicide run. We don't... I can do it. Joker? I can do it. Gear up and head down to the Mako. Joker! Drop us right on top of that bastard. And here we go. I thought we'd already ended the moon relay, but apparently now we have. <sighs> the things we're talking about with Liara there at the end of that conversation and event sounded rather final. Makes me a bit uh, unnerved. Hmm. We'll take Tally and we'll take Liara. We might need Tally's technical expertise and Liara's biotics would definitely come in handy. Yeah, let's do this. this bunker before Saren finds the conduit. There is no way we're getting past that door with brute force. Saren found some way to open it. There must be some kind of security override somewhere in this complex. We will have to find some way to get it up and running again. I guess that's our cue. There's the landing zone. Now is not the time. Like, oh, hi. Got it. That's the last of them. Oh, hell. Let's 
There's another gift over this way. Whew. Well, welcome to Ilos, everyone. Let's do a proper exploration now that we've cleared most of the area. So there is an elevator here. Bugger. Not having much luck. Fine, we'll override it. Nothing that's really useful. Is there anything down here? Negative contact, Shepard. Oh great, we're being jammed. What the these things. Statues? Profians, maybe? This leads us back to the other stairway. So, oh, hello. Um, oh. Geth armature control? Well, I guess I won't complain if it actually is. Even though we... I wonder if that's the two armatures that we took care of up there. We actually took them out already. Maybe. Let's keep exploring. We need to find that... way into... well beyond the doorway there that Seth just passed through. Oh. Well, we got another grenade off that Geth Trooper. Good. Good. And now we're back up to the upper level. Yeah, okay. Anything around this corner? Doesn't seem to be. I wish I had more time to study all of this. We shouldn't be here. Not us. Not the Geth. Not Seren. A lot of strangely petrified plant life. Well, we saw some of these, like, kind of statues in our... in that vision we had. Bloody hell. Well, that works. Nice work with a singularity. Ooh. Okay, where does this go? To absolutely nowhere. Oh. 
Uh, looks like... Oh, this is only the courtyard. Okay. Maybe we can go down this way. Didn't we just come from that way, though? Maybe I missed something. Ah, okay. Oh, great. Being jammed again. Great, overheated. Well, it could have been worse. They could have jumped on us while we were dealing with the Geth Destroyer and the other Geth down there. Oh, this is an elevator. Okay. Where does it elevate us to? Oh, well, we're descending, actually. This place still has power. It must be running off its own generator. This must be the command center for the entire complex. Saren's troops must have sealed the doors from here after he went inside. We will have to figure out how to disengage the security lockdown if we ever want to get inside that bunker. What's that? Armature repair station. Bloody hell. Oh, Tally. Um, up. Probably why we needed the armatures, eh? Alright, oh, we could have used the armatures to fight against the the primes and such. Surprise, we repair them and they're automatically on our side? Guess I shouldn't complain. Survivor 8 armor for. Ooh. For Tally. Yeah, nowhere near as good. Come, Saren already has a head start. We have to go find him before he reaches the conduit. Unless he's already found it. Then we're just walking into a trap. That is a chance we will have to take. Hold on. Something's happening. Too late. Unable to... Invading fleets. No escape. It sounds like some kind of message, but I don't recognize the language. It is probably in Prothean. This recording must be 50,000 years old. No wonder we cannot understand it. 
the message is all broken up, but I recognize some of the words. It's a warning against the Reaper invasion. Of course. Between the beacons and the cipher, an understanding of the Prothean language would have been transferred into your mind. Not safe. Seek refuge. Inside the archives. What's it saying? Can you make out anything useful? Fought Reapers. The Citadel. Overwhelmed. Only hope. of desperation. The conduit... All is lost! It said something about the conduit, but it's too degraded to help. We should go. Cannot be stopped! Cannot be stopped! That's not good. So much history here, so much to learn. I only hope I have the chance to come back someday. Okay, I think we've opened the door now to chase after Saren. Let's get ourselves back up to the plaza, which is where I think this elevator takes us. So Who votes we take the vehicle into the creepy underground bunker? Good idea. The firepower will come in handy. Okay. I will end this video here and when we come back we'll be chasing after Saren. Try to stop him before he gets to the conduit, whatever the conduit happens to be. But I hope you've all enjoyed this. Of course, it's been Anflo playing Mass Effect. Feel free to comment below, and I will see you for even more, potentially the finale video, depending on how long the next videos take, of course. Until next time, though, bye bye now.